For this one, you are going to start out with a grid, but instead of drawing lines, you're actually going to draw little dots in a grid shape. If it's easier for you to do um, intersecting lines to begin with and then add that dot on there, you could certainly do that as well. So what I mean by that is if you want to get this straight on, drawing a light line first would be okay and then making the dark dot in each section to begin with. Then eventually you go back and get rid of that line. Okay, now for this next part, I'm actually going to flip this, it makes more sense to me, and we're going to add a line in and a line out. A line in and out. Then you'll do just the opposite on the next, um, next group. So line in towards each other, line out towards, or away from one another. Line in, line out. And again, the opposite. Now that in itself could actually be um, a zentangle, but we're going to bring it a step further. So wherever I went up, now I'm going to do the same thing here, going in, going out, going in, going out. And the opposite on the other side. And this one to me is a little bit difficult. Maybe it makes sense to you right away. But my brain has to work on it. Then what you could do is take your pencil and make this look like it's being woven in. So what I would do on each of these ends is I'd kind of darken some of these every other so that it looks like it's being woven within that shape. Mine is not as successful as the one that I was looking at. This is the one that I'm looking at. That might help you out a little bit more than looking at mine. So following the steps along here might give you more of a successful tangle.